The number of migrants apprehended by U.S. immigration agents after crossing the southern border illegally has soared to near record levels in September alone. And according to Border Patrol agents, roughly 140,000 migrants have been apprehended at the U.S.-Mexico border during the first 20 days of this month. Mexican President Obrador has called a meeting of foreign ministers from 10 countries and around Latin America to discuss the situation. Our next report gives you all the details. Mexican President Andres Manuel López Obrador on Wednesday called for a regional meeting to discuss migration as a record number of people tried the dangerous crossing through the Darien Gap. He said a joint meeting was needed to not only protect migrants, but to combat the root causes that forced so many from Venezuela, Cuba, and countries in Central America to leave their homes. Y que nosotros tenemos que cuidarlos. Almost all of them pass through Mexico, and we must take care of migrants and protect them, but we must avoid an increase of the migrant flux because there are risks. Obrador said the meeting would take place in approximately 10 days with the foreign ministers of 10 Latin American countries. On Tuesday, the Mexican government's migration authority said it had deployed over 260 buses and vans to disperse over 8,000 migrants from the southern city of Tapachula, near the border with Guatemala to other parts of the country. In recent weeks, large numbers of migrants have been crossing into the United States from Mexico, piling pressure on the Biden administration to stem the flow of people as the U.S. 2024 presidential election race begins to heat up.